The LAPD welcomes a new batch of newly sworn officers to its ranks. Gil Reyes reports from LAPD Graduation Day, where we're reminded that physical toughness is just part of the job. Going out to the field, you guys should be just like you are now for the next year, and you won't have any problems. Instructors giving final advice to a group of cadets before they officially become LAPD officers. It's graduation day. That pep talk being given here at the Elysian Park Academy just moments before the actual ceremony. And all 31 LAPD officers are graduating today. 26 men, 5 women. City leaders first thanked the officers' families. The academy can teach a lot of things like defense tactics, weapons handling, and emergency aid. But Chief Charlie Beck acknowledges that the most important thing is something only families can teach. And that is the ability to do the right thing when no one else is looking and when it involves somebody that can do nothing for them. To your family and friends, thank you. This is the product of your work and of your love. Officer Velvet Davis looks forward to getting to know LA's diverse communities. We don't see a lot of female officers and we also don't see a lot of officers of color. So that's what I wanted to um, just personally strive to inspire younger individuals, especially in the inner city where I came from. If they see more of what looks like them, it'll inspire to make a bigger difference. It's an honor, sir. It's an honor to wear this badge, uh, wear the uniform. And uh, my biggest goal is to make the city of Los Angeles proud. Congratulations to all the graduates from Elysian Park. I'm Gil Reyes for LA This Week. Also graduating, two officers who will go on to serve with the Los Angeles World Airport Police.